Hey, good Monday morning, everyone. It's uh, 21 News Chief Meteorologist Eric Wilhelm. It's an update on your Monday weather. We've been advertising today as a, a pretty wet, unsettled day, and I still think that is the case. But now that we're you know in the short range, we want to get to the finer details, tell you exactly when the heaviest rain's likely, thunderstorms, any severe weather, all that good stuff. It's very warm. It's very humid outside this morning. Temperatures did not drop out of the 70s overnight. And uh, we're in the mid-70s right now at 9.05 a.m. Now, we are dry, and there's even a few peaks of sun trying to uh, pop through. There can be that on occasion today, but generally, of course, a pretty cloudy day for us today. A little bit of light rain out in central Ohio this morning, and as we look at the region, there are no big, heavy thunderstorms at the moment. Uh, but uh, again, that may change as we get into the afternoon. Uh, real quick word on the temperatures. Uh, you know, already 78 in New Philly. It's in the mid-70s everywhere, and it's really, really humid. Dew points are in the mid-60s. You step out there this morning, and it really hits you. It's, it's real muggy. Um, we're going to get a break from the humidity tomorrow, but today is going to be a, a very humid day. Now, we are keeping an eye on the possibility of some heavier storms today. The main threat is going to be southeast of Youngstown. See, we're going to see the yellow area here. That's the Storm Prediction Center's slight risk uh, zone. That's overall where the highest risk of severe weather is today. It includes central PA, southwestern PA, and southern Ohio. Uh, it does not include the WFMJ viewing area, although the top edge gets very close to Columbia County. We're in the, uh, the marginal risk today, which is a lower category uh, than slight. I do think there can be some thunder and lightning this afternoon here and there, and certainly some heavy rain a possibility. But the possibility of damaging winds, large hail, pretty small here locally. We can't rule it out, but it's pretty small. I think your overall highest risk is down towards Cambridge and points south and east. One thing for sure, we have a lot of moisture in the air today. Here's something a little different for you. This is what we call precipitable water. It's a, it's a kind of a variable we look at when we want to see how moist the air column is from the ground all the way up. And when, when these values, these precipitable water values are very high, that means heavy, heavy rain can occur in some of the stronger storms. They can then wring out a lot of moisture. And so even though the threat for severe weather isn't super high today, we are going to have to watch out for maybe some street and highway flooding and flooding in areas of poor drainage if we were to get a couple of heavier storms because the there's a lot of juice in the atmosphere today. So that's one thing we'll have to watch out for. Precipitable water values are between an inch and a half and two inches today, and that's that's pretty high. And that usually happens when it's, when it's this humid. All right, real quickly, uh, a little tour of the short-range model here, the simulated radar product on the high-resolution rapid refresh model. Um, this is our real high-resolution short-term model. Um, it tends to look overdone sometimes, um, but we use it as a guide, and you know it, it is useful in the first 12 to 15 hours. Anyway, here's the midday simulated radar. Not much happening just yet. This is at 11 a.m., but you'll notice what happens here as we get into the afternoon. Rain becomes a little more likely. Here's uh, 2 p.m. Uh, it's going to be scattered about, and it may not be all that heavy early in the afternoon. Um, could be a little pocket of heavier rain, but widespread heavy rain not real likely early in the afternoon. Here's 4 p.m. Scattered showers around. Could be some thunder. And this is one we'll be keeping a, a real close eye on parts of uh, southern Ohio. Southeast Ohio into southwest PA, could be some heavier storms, and then there could be another round of heavier storms trying to crop up out here in Indiana late in the afternoon and heading into the evening. That's also likely to dive southeast of us overnight tonight. But, uh, you know, this could be a pretty impressive looking, you know, little bow echo here uh, during this evening. So, as you can see, rain is likely off and on afternoon and evening across the Mahoning and Shenango Valleys today, but you know, I'm not looking for much in the way of large scale damaging winds. Uh, too many clouds around today, not enough instability, I think. But uh, certainly be look, on the lookout for some heavier rain and some of these some of these beefier showers. All right, I'm playing in the uh, American Heart Association's uh, annual golf scramble with Dana Bolish this afternoon. Andrew's going to cover for me at 6, but I'll be in tonight on 21 News at 11. So since I'll be out on the golf course this afternoon, updates will be a little bit more sparse than usual. Uh, be sure to check out the radar on WFMJ.com slash weather and stay weather aware on this uh, moist, humid, unsettled Monday. Have a great day.